Hey, we zombie slayers out there, it's Parker, you're from the CK channel, and welcome back to actually a pretty exciting video today, because what we're going to be talking about is something that, for, for me personally, like, I'm a little bit anxious for this, but then again, like, I'm really stoked, but what we're going to be talking about in today's video, what the main topic is going to be about, is upcoming news that we'll hopefully receive in the next couple weeks from now, regarding the next Call of Duty game, and I know we're only a close to three months in for Call of Duty Ghost, and we're really Really, really soon it's going to be hearing information and news regarding the next Call of Duty title and it's going to be pretty intense and it is going to involve you zombie slayers out there just or if you're just a regular multiplayer user for Call of Duty it's going to affect you guys both so that's why I thought this would be actually a pretty appropriate commentary for today's video and that's something that I'm going to be talking about and I am going to be having a predicament on when I actually believe we will start hearing news on the next Call of Duty game and I think it's actually going to be pretty solid because I do have some research and some information that I do want to share with you guys because I did do a little bit of research for about 30 minutes and I think I actually got some really solid information for you guys so let's get right into it so for the information I'm going to be presenting to you guys with it's just basically going to be the first news that we heard about from uh, from next Call of Duty games that were from previous Call of Duty games so I know that might not make that much sense but theoretically let's pretend we're all the way back in 2009 and 2010 almost in that MW2 gaming era and we were first actually able to receive news from the next Call of Duty game that was going to be for Black Ops in the time for MW2's era we were actually first able to hear news about that in mid February of 2010 and that was sort of actually the start of when we were first hearing that information pretty early because I did a little bit more research among the other Call of Duty games previous to Black Ops and it was sort of like a little bit scrambled like some dates were in April and it, it didn't really make that much sense but there's actually kind of almost a little bit of an algorithm going on now and that's sort of something that I'm going to be talking about so go going back on, on on the topic and what we're talking about we we're actually able to receive Black Ops information in, in mid-February of 2010 and then going along with that when we were first able to hear about MW3 information or the first news that was linked that was all that was surprisingly enough in late January rather in somewhere along the lines of late February or something like that we were actually able to receive news of MW3 in late January and what we were actually able to decipher from that news is the actual name of the game itself we were able all the way back from January of 2011 I believe what the new Call of Duty game was actually going to be called from back then, all, all the way from Black Ops. It's actually pretty, pretty insane that we were able, only from like that two month difference from when Black Ops was released, we were able to all already know what the next Call of Duty title was going to be called. A little insane, nothing's like that has happened currently as of right now for any of these Call of Duty titles, and it's already way too late for Call of Duty Ghost's uh, lifespan for it to actually to actually for us to hear some news regarding the next Call of Duty game, but I might as well just go along with some of the more information that I have. So, for Black Ops 2, and we were actually able to receive information on that regarding, regarding just, I, I believe if I'm not mistaken, the gaming title itself, we were able to know that in mid-February of 2012, I believe. And going along with this as well, we might as well just finish up with Ghost. We were actually able to receive our first information of Call of Duty Ghost coming out in late February of 2013. So, all these dates have a really primal example, a really primal date, I should say. And it's somewhere just adding this up. It's We should, theoretically, be receiving news for this next Call of Duty game coming out sometime in in mid February that that's kind of my prediction that I when I the uh, just based off of this information because you have to take it for what it is for black ops We were able to receive its first information in mid-february for mw3 It was like late January Which is something that we've really haven't seen in a while and then just for black ops We were able to receive information on that in mid-february and then for call of duty ghost. It was late February so 
like just by adding these numbers up, it, it seems like it would be it would make sense for us to hear some first Call of Duty news regarding the next Call of Duty game somewhere in mid February. That that's really my prediction. Whether or not it will come true, I truly don't know. But really, the the math should all add up here, and something we should actually be receiving some information probably a, like through the dates of February 10th, probably maybe even through February 20th. That that's really when I believe we're actually gonna first start hearing some news on the next Call of Duty game. The the thing I I'm really anxious about. And I know I was mentioning this earlier in t in today's video is uh, it's it's gonna be interesting because really for me and also for all these other previous Call of Duty games as well. During those dates on when we were able to hear the first news, we were actually able to know the developers that were actually making the Call of Duty game. And I know the problem that's going along right now is that some people think that Treyarch's going to be making the next Call of Duty game or Sledgehammer Games is going to be making the next Call of Duty game. That's really the main contributing factor because if Sledgehammer Games is actually, is, if Sledgehammer Games is going to be the only company making this next Call of Duty title, that means that we're not going to have zombies for another year and it's something that it, it's going to be rough for me personally like and probably for everybody on our channel if you're a huge zombies fanatic it's going to be something that's going to be quite devastating and it's going to really hurt the zombie community but then again it's like I, I don't think I could play just the zombies that we have right now for another year and it'd actually be quite rough but hopefully fingers crossed Treyarch is going to be making this next Call of Duty game just hopefully everything goes well and hopefully we'll be able to receive information about that regarding all, regarding all that stuff and we'll hopefully fingers crossed be able to receive information on the developers because it, it shouldn't really be different from what we've actually received in the past hopefully it'll just be around that mid-february date in which we'll be able to receive only just the developers that are working on it the companies for that because i think that would be more appropriate and just really i don't care about what the next call of duty title is going to be if I, if I just know that Treyarch is going to be making it i know that zombies are going to be in it and i know overall it's going to be a great game and i'm probably going to buy it but, th but really, th that's about it. If, if you guys have heard any other news regarding these Call of Duty games, and when you personally believe we'll start hearing news about it, leave a comment down below because I'd be interested to hear or just to see what you guys said. But other than that, guys, my name is Parker. Hopefully, you guys are having a wonderful and fabulous and super fantastic day today because I certainly am. And I guess I'll talk to you guys in the next video.